madness, ladies and gentlemen. NYSC Einstein from the Florida New York Stock Exchange. We got wild. We got crazy. We got markets up and down, in and out, sideways. We don't even know what's going on. Today was amazing. We opened up we were really close. We got in with about 90 points of, 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 of Dow 20,000. And then what we've been waiting for all this time was the Fed. The Fed, the Fed. Are they going to raise rates? We knew they would. Everyone said it's priced in. What does that mean? Dow Jones up at 19, 9, 30, and it's priced in. Normally, interest rate raises are negative, bearish, market, people selling equities, getting into bonds and treasury. What are they talking about? It's priced in. So what does that mean? That when they actually raise the rate, the market's not going to do anything? Ah, wrong. Net, net. Today, 2 o'clock, what did in fact happen? We posted out with a big sell and balance. The Fed came out. They raised rates, 25 basis points. Oh, my God. What are we going to do? Okay. And then the whole thing is about Mrs. Yellen's guidance, how much they're going to do, when they're going to do it, and whatnot. What's changed? What's changed? A month ago, we weren't going to do anything. We were not going to raise them until late September. What happened? Suddenly, we got a president. Suddenly, we got some economic policy. Suddenly, something changed that made her decide in three weeks to raise the friggin' rates and then come out with the fact that they're going to do three more raises in 17. Is the economy in that good shape? Are they just going to do that because the market's on fire? What changed? New rules? I I don't really know. Not that much except the fact that the uncertainty about the fact that we now have a president, we've now got pro-growth, manufacturing, infrastructure, tax rebates, and whatnot, right? How do we engage this president? Do it from the right side. Engage him. Make a meeting. Make a deal. That's how he works. Don't talk about him behind his back. Ladies and gentlemen, what happened? They raised the rates. She came out with three more raises coming out in September. Market popped on up to, up to, up to, up to 19,950 within 40 points, I think. Uh, basically 20,000 and then basically the bearishness of our interest rate raise kicked in. Market sold off hard. Down about 150, almost 200 points from its high. We're closing at 19,792, uh, down 120 points. Was that a significant move on the downside for a market ra raise with guidance going forward? Not really. Relatively, in the old days, September last year, we would have been down 1,000 points. But no, only down a buck 20, down a buck 50 at its low. We've got support. There's market interest there on the buy side. Are we going to see a further little bit of a sell-off? I don't know. Are we going to march our way all the way down to 20,000 tomorrow? It's very possible. We've got big rebounds. Friday's a huge day. Okay? It's December. The end of the year's coming up. I think the market still forges on. I don't think this is the beginning of a bigger, bigger sale. Okay? So, all that being said, I'm frenetic. It's crazy. Market's wild. We did have our first sell-side day in a long time. It made sense. Market's bearish over interest rate raise. But net-net at the end of the day... Better raise rates while the market's roaring. Sell when you can, not what you have to. Giddy up, this market's on fire. Down 120 is nothing compared to what could have been. That's all I got to say. I'm wild. I'm crazy. It's crazy. It's wild. Dow Jones and Nuster average. Gold down 14. Russell down. Spies down. Clearly a sell side day. Makes perfect sense. Forget that. It's priced in crap. That has nothing to do with anything. The market's on fire. We have a little bit of a pause, a little bit of profit taking, a little bit of sell side. That's all. Tomorrow's another day. I love you. Goodbye.